The UK government like to claim that the UK's national debt is, at this precise point in time, £2,659 billion. That is a lot of money. And their claim is wrong. The UK's national debt is not £2,659 billion. And there is one very simple and very good reason for that, which is that of that sum, £733 billion is owed by the UK government to themselves. And look, if you owe yourself money, you're not going to get too worried about it, are you? Nor are you going to get too worried about how much interest you have to pay on it, are you? But they do, which is quite absurd. But when we take that debt, which is the money that they own as a consequence of quantitative easing, which arose during the global financial crisis of 2008, and the COVID crisis of 2020-21 out of consideration, then the UK's national debt falls to £1,926 billion. Well, look, that still sounds like a lot of money. But in comparison to our total national income, the figure that they claim of £2,659 billion is 97.3% of our total national income. Whereas the true number and I am quite sure that that is the maximum debt they can talk about, is only 70.5% of UK national income. And frankly, at that level, nobody thinks that national debt matters. Nobody thinks that it has an impact upon the way in which we can manage our economy and nobody worries about repaying it. So why don't they tell the truth? That is a really difficult question to answer, and I'm afraid to say, you have to ask them and not me.